welcome to our outdoor gym in Ira Grande. Today we're going through our six best isometric exercises. Chloe's going to be showing you how it's done. I'm going to be talking you through it. So let's start with number one. Or number six, if we work from the top, our deep squats. Chloe, show us how it's done. We're wanting feet around about shoulder width apart, sitting down into your deep squat. Chloe's got great squat mobility. For me, it's a lot harder. Okay. Whatever it is for you, spend some time in that position. If you do struggle, elevate your heels and sit down. This is one of the best for opening hips, strengthening glutes, reducing lower back pain. From here, we want to make it a little bit better. We can even add a little reach. But the key part is our isometric squat. We are staying in our hold and in our hips. Feels good? It always feels great, that Excellent. one. Excellent. Hey, we have a friend. Hello. Let's take you through exercise or number five. We're going to be going for our isometric push-up position. So, Chloe, bring yourself into a push-up position for me. Yep. Beautiful. If we now descend into the bottom of that push-up and hold. Let's really try to get posterior pelvic tilt, squeeze those glutes, this is hard. We've got strong shoulder blades, this is warming pecs, shoulders, Chloe's already shaking. Bring yourself up for me. And relax, beautiful. Isometric push-up, amazing work for the upper body. Brilliant before any likes of pushing and a very humbling exercise as you can tell. Chloe can smash a lot of push-ups. We're gonna go for number four. Our isometric basket hang. So if you can grab. Hanging in general is a brilliant exercise as we know and preach here at Master Movement. Can we bring those knees up towards the chest? It's our basket hang. Suddenly, isometric hold through the core. Chloe's gonna be shaking in seconds. Also opening shoulders, lengthening spine, really working the core. There's a lot of benefits. Oh. Relax there. Beautiful exercise, the basket hang. Exercise number. Three, we're going to go for a side plank with a banded rope. Show you how this looks. Okay, if you bring yourself into a side plank on your right side for me. Take the band in your hand and give that a pull into a row position. Good, we're gonna hold core tight, hips up from the floor, glutes really strong. Just that isometric row and hold, really gonna get the back doing much more here as well. Just making that side plank slightly more effective. Chloe, can you lift your leg up, your left leg up for me? Really bring those hips forwards. Now we've got side plank, row and abduction, even harder, relax there. A lot of progression and regression with these moves. A wonderful core exercise. We're gonna come into exercise two, our glute bridge ab hold. Set yourself up, Chloe, feet facing this way. Firstly, into a glute bridge position. So first things I want Chloe to think about is starting with a flat back on the floor, posterior pelvic tilt. Engage glutes and abs, let's drive our hips up towards the sky. Beautiful, we've got straight, good control through our core and hips. We're gonna grab the band, straighten those arms for me and pull those down, squeeze your lats, beautiful. No need to actually make contact here, try to, good. Just holding that band above is really gonna activate the core a lot more, we're activating the back. We've got a whole posterior chain fired up, perfect before the likes of deadlifts or swings. Chloe's already feeling the heat, relax off there for me, and voila, great job. We have made it to our best, our favorite isometric exercise. This is our isometric split squat with a paloff press. So, I'm gonna ask you to find your split squat to start with, Chloe. You're gonna call this the open side because she's got her closest leg open towards the band. Again, I'm looking at that posterior pelvic tilt, hips under, it's gonna open the hip flexor, it's gonna squeeze the glutes and core. Gonna get you now give Chloe the band to hold front of the chest and to push it forwards and hold. One, relax. 
Let's now try it on the closed side, facing the same way. We're just switching the legs so the closest leg is closed off to the band. Posterior pelvic tilt, open the hips, get your glutes firing, core engaged, bring it in front and fight to hold that position. Five, four, three, two, and one. Relax. You would now do that facing the other way, but believe me, you're gonna open up your hips, you're gonna work every muscle in that body, and you're gonna get really, really strong doing it. How do we feel? Yeah, that's tough work. Six of our best isometric exercises, get them going. Guys, peace and love, thanks for watching. Thank if you enjoyed you the video, share the love. Thank you, Chloe.